Hello and hey there everybody. What's going on and how are you doing out there? And hey to the chat here on Twitch. Hope everyone is all right and well enjoying your day on this Sunday. And this is Dirty Gamer and I'm here on Fortnite for the quest and the item shop update rundown for today, July 23rd, 2023. 72323. So allow me to take time and shout out and thanks to all my uh, subscribers and followers. And if you are new to my channel or a new viewer, welcome to my lair. Showing support by viewing, liking up, thumbs up, sharing my videos takes just a button click all without my content to be seen and have those bell notifications turned on. All is appreciated. For those new to my channels and new viewers, subscribe on my YouTube and follow me on Twitch. Both are free and I appreciate you all very much for doing that. All right, so I expect kind of a light situation today. Um, although since the last time that I streamed, there was a couple of changes that they do have here on the update. We'll get through them. So as you can see here, starting at the top, we do have, oh, actually it's not on the top anymore. Oh boy, they did the squad origins. They just had like, I don't know why they keep bringing these back. These styles from every chapter in season one. So this is becoming another copy and paste situation that, frankly, very tired about, uh, tired of. And they, they don't stop. I don't know why they keep bringing these back, like, literally less than a month. Uh, so just to double check here, the season signature. Yeah, 36 days ago at June 18th, they really got to stop with these. Like, I, people, I just don't, I'm tired of, like, seeing the same stuff literally between a 20 to 60-day time period. Um, I don't know what these guys are doing, but they keep just regurgitating the same stuff. So, here's the backlinks, kind of holographic, so you can get some of the Season 1 here. So, uh, Bella Prime, Dub Dragon, Dusty Danger, Visitor's Victory, Mass Drifts, The Cube... The Ice Bling, Banana Nana, and Neo Future, and Memory X. That's 400 uh, V-Bucks for that backlink. And then for each of these individual styles, they're 1,200 each. Uh, or you can get them in bundles. This First Fighters or the Early Explorers is 2,800. So let me just go through each one individually. So just to show, based off this Lucky Leader... You're going to get all these different styles. You have First Flight, Fortnite, Meteor Strike, Launched, Drifted, Cube Rising, Iced, Peeled. Again, they go based off the season, Neo Royale from Chapter 1 and x Out. So based off that, obviously, you're just going to have different palette, you know, different swaps of the characters. So here's Salty Striker, Tilted Trooper, Risky Raider, Dusty Daredevil. Fearless Flusher, Wailing Warrior, Recline Raider, Motto Marauder, Pleasant Patroller. Uh, and again, individually 1200 The bundle, by the way, will come with the gangs all here loading screen for both of them, in case you were interested. Uh, Alright, so we're on to the feature tab here. This also looks like a pretty copy and paste situation with this Overseer bundle. This costs 3000 It's a seven-item bundle. This was just offered a month ago on June 23rd, a mere 31 days ago. So, again, they're holding firm to what I've noticed is their turnaround between 20 to, like, 60-something days, or in some cases, even less. So, just to show you what's in the seven-item bundle, you get this Fade Outfit, Ominous or Backbling, Omen Outfit, Battle Shroud Backbling, Faded, Frame Pickaxe, I don't know about you, but this sounds really tinny to me. This, yeah, that's really weak. Uh, the Oracle Axe, Pickaxe, that sounds a little better. And then the Split Wing Glider, which is only eh, not great. Uh, so individually, each outfit is 2,000 because they consider these legendary, which I disagree with. Uh, the pickaxe, well, the faded frame is 800, while the oracle is 1200, as well as that glider. All very overpriced, in my humble, firm opinion. 
And then we have the Markman bundle, which I do recommend. The bundle is 2300 uh, V-Bucks. Just show you what it includes here. You can include these six items. So you get this grimy outfit. It is reactive. You will get those souls in the Fallen that appear on the outfit. But just to make you aware, um, it limits it to, I believe, 10, right? Yeah, which is disappointing because for each elimination, you should if you have more than 10 eliminations, you guys should be able to put more than 10 on that. The Glumbo Backbling, which is reactive, uh, when you eliminate, kind of chomps down and get that soul on you. The graf Grafitax, which I kind of like, actually. Get that drift from it. Again, I do like the look you get from these. Oh, and can't forget the grimy outfit with that drip that comes off the outfit as well. Kind of like that inked look. And, of course, the drip dropper glider. The Grimule's Wrap, which is pretty cool because it is reactive it will, and animated. Um, let me see if it lets me... Yeah, the problem is it won't show, obviously, the reactive part of it when you because you have to get the elimination just to show you what it looks like a little. And then the pen and ink pals loading screen. So it is a decent value for 2300 considering the outfit's $1,500, um, and then the pickaxe and the glider, $800 each, and the wraps, $500. All right, this is another copy and paste special here with the peekaboo outfit uh, for 1500 Last offer June 24th at a mere 30 days ago. I'm thinking it's going to be the case for this night night. Yes, it is. And the pick squeak pickaxe as well. Um, I don't know why these aren't bundled at this point. It just doesn't make any sense. So here's the peekaboo outfit. You get a creepy look, creepier, and sneaky peek. Uh, you also get a battle balloon back bling, which, I don't know, a bit, bit disappointing in my opinion about that. Uh, well, let me see. Was there anything else with that? No, no other styles. The night night outfit for 1500 male equivalent. Kind of looks a lot like Ronald McDonald to me. The creepy, creepier and the Night Fright, and then the boony, the Balloon Llama Backling, and then the pick, Sweet Pickaxe, which is also 1500 Each of these are 1500 It just seems a bit overpriced to me, though, all these. And once again, the glitch out where I can't swing the pickaxe. Now I can. Sounds a bit like squeaky. Uh, then we have the Operation Black Tabby Bundle. Again, another copy and paste special. Uh, for 1600 this five-item bundle just offered on June 21st at a mere 33 days ago. So includes this five items. Going to include the Panther, uh, excuse me, the Uwu Visor, the Perfect Targeting, Nocturnal Vision, and Cat Lateral. So the Visor only changes the outfits the same. A Panther's Cross Fangs Back Bling, a Panther Tooth Pickaxe, a bit weak to me for that sound effect. Then we have the Panther's Call Wrap. It is animated. The, the animation's pretty subtle. It's only towards the front of the weapon, just to show you. Uh, and then the uh, banner, the uncommon banner, I guess. Doesn't even, it doesn't even have a name. That's weird. I don't think I've ever seen a banner that just doesn't have a name for it. That's odd. Uh, individually, the outfit's 1,200. The pickaxe is 800, and the wrap is five. On to the daily tab, kind of a home of a lot of uh, copy and paste specials here, with the Bracer outfit for 800 last offered on June 18th at the mere 36 days ago, as you can see here, it's 800 uh, The Oblivion outfit, which I do recommend, uh, that's going to be, it's 2000 by the way, I do own it, so you get this default and this gold, which I do like a lot, you do stand out, but I do dig it. And then the destabilizer backling, you get a default and a gold. And then the we got a red streak pickaxe. Trying to see when this was. Oh, by the way, the oblivion. Yeah, June 19th at 35 days ago. In case I didn't mention that. Then the red streak pickaxe for 500. Last offered on March 8th at 138 days ago. So a little bit longer than the usual turnaround time. I don't know. Pretty basic, a bit tinny sounding. Then we have the Shattered Ice Wrap, which I do recommend for 500 Last offered on June 16th, under mere 38 days ago. It is a reactor wrap that animates when firing. But for some reason, it doesn't let you fire to show that animation. Really odd that you can't even do that. All right, so now we're on to the emotes here. So let me just take a quick uh, pause the BGM. And then I'll play these emotes for you here. So... So here's the Rocket Rodeo. This has also kind of been a common one, copy and pasting here for 800 
Last offer June nineteenth again, a mere thirty five days ago. And pretty weak, especially eight hundred, I think is a lot. Then we have the all snap uh emote. What's weird is this was just offered yesterday, and this is here on the daily tab, which is really strange. Um, so I guess this is new also from the last time I streamed. And that's it. Wow, for 200. Uh, I think that should even be less. Okay, so they did bring back the Across the Spider Verse. This was something that was um, before they re released this. Uh, when was this? Yesterday. Before that was June 7th at 47 days ago. So. Just to show you, I do recommend it. Now, I actually got this bundle a lot cheaper because I happened to do a quest that actually worked, unlike some of these other quests, for the Spider Ham's Hamlet, which knocked down a decent um, number of the, the price for the, the bundle. Uh, the bundle itself is actually 2600 It's going to include all these items, a total of eight. It's going to have the Spider-Man Miles Morales, the Earth-1610, and the, you know, unmasked look, if that's what you want to call that here. The Spider-Verse Portal Backling, the Spider-Man 2099 Outfits, the 2099 Web Cape, and as you can see here, use the Putter There emote as another way to equip the Spider-Ham's Mallet Pickaxe. Bundle includes loading screen, so that's the mallet. And as you can see there, it does swing, albeit, although be it a bit weakly on that. And then the here's the Porter there emote, which is kind of very Looney Tunes sounding to me. Uh, but that's kind of funny, I guess. And then this, the 928 Axes pickaxe. It's an okay sound and an okay effect. And then the Mega City Swing loading screen, which actually does look all right. So there is some value here from that bundle, uh, considering individually each outfit is 1500 the mallet is a thousand, and the pickaxe, a 928 uh, pickaxe is 500. All right, and now for they brought back a few Marvel items. Um, they split them up. I don't know why they did that. Last time they had Marvel, they only had a couple, and this one they have some more. So I do recommend, for example, this Venom outfit. Uh, it is 2000, and you're gonna get Venom here, you get two looks, you get a default with that nice symbiote coming off here and the extreme, which shows even more of it. I prefer the extreme, obviously. And then the tendril toe back wing. Uh, you can see it is reactive. You can see it kind of spreads out there. And then the symbiote slasher pickaxe, which only Venom can, uh, can use and equip. And they get a real decent sound and effect, unlike several of these other pickaxes. And then the We Are Venom emote, which again, I do dig a lot. And then the Spider-Man Zero bundle. So this, oh, and just to make you aware, Venom was last offered you, uh, b before yesterday. Let me see. Uh, oh, wow, look, March 11th, 135 days ago. It's probably going to be the same for most of these, if not all these other ones, since they split up these Marvel releases. Yeah, same thing for Spider-Man as well. And let me just double-check if that's the same for Mary Jane. Most likely it is. Yeah, so I think all these are going to have that same thing. So the Spider-Man Zero Bundle, it's a bundle, It's a, for 1800 you include these four items. You get the Spider-Man Zero outfit, the Spider Drone backwing, a web slicer pickaxe. It's a decent sound and effect with the web coming out there, and then the Spidey landing emo. Again, definitely like that move. And then, uh, in, just to make you aware, um, individually, what's what's interesting is you can. Oh, okay, they do have it individually. So individually, the outfit is there is value because fifteen hundred for the outfit, eight hundred for the pickaxe, and three hundred for the uh, email. So you're just better off getting the bundle eighteen hundred. Then we have the Mary Jane outfit for fifteen hundred, only one look. She comes with a web shredder backling and a web web shredder pickaxe, which is kind of cool looking, and it does sound like a guitar riff off that. Then the Green Goblin Bundle. So this is for 2100 I think all these other Marvel ones are going to be, yeah, around the same time, 135 days. All right, so we'll just continue. So six-item bundle for 2100 
So here's the outfit, a pumpkin bomb backling, the arm, the pumpkin emo. There you go. And then the pumpkin PX pickaxe. It's a decent sound, I guess. And then the goblin glider glider. There you go. And the attack of the goblin loading screen. So individually, outfits 1500. The gliders, the glider and pickaxe are eight, and the emote is two. So on to the Deadpool mashups for item bundle for 2000. Raven pool outfit, Raven pool's cage backling, cuddle pool outfits, cuddle pool's bow backling. I really rather just have Deadpool. Uh, and individually, the outfits are 1500, and they each do come with their backling. Now, if you want the gear bundle, which I find kind of, it is, it is sold separately, so you do have to pay uh, this extra 2000 which is, I think is a bit much of an ask. For a bundle here, so you get the Dragacorn Glider, which is an interesting deploy, just notice that. The Scooting Emote, it is a traversal. And then this Chimichanga Emote, which I might get, because I thought, I forgot to get it the last time, just to let it play through here. You can see he's just burning that burrito. And it's one of the longer emotes, too. See the smoke coming out of it there? The sparks flying. Ah, this thing really goes for this long? I thought this was a little shorter. I think it's just it just sits there burnt like that. I thought this actually had an ending. Well, I'll move on. The meaty mallet's pickaxe. That's definitely one of the longest I've ever seen of a hemo. Kind of weak. So individually, the glider's 1500, the pickaxe is eight, the scooting emote's 500, and the chimichanga is 300. All right, so it looks like we've reached the repeat portion here of the Heroes of Tamriel slash uh, Elder Scrolls Online tying is still here. So what did change was this John Cena bundle, which I think came in after, since my last stream. Let me just double check when that was. What's weird is it's not like there's like a WWE event or anything like that. So before then, it was on July 2nd, 22 days ago. So this is starting to become a repetitive, like even less than a month. So, four item bundle for 2000 you get the John Cena outfits, you get a default and a ring gear, so basically shirt on and shirt off, that's how I look at it. The WWE Championship title backling, a five digit slapper pickaxe, uh, excuse me, pickaxe, which again still won't let me demo it. Very weak sounding, and then the You Can't See Me emote. And that's it. Individually, the outfit's 1500, the pickaxe is 8, and the emote is 400. And I think we're back to the repeat portion again with this cause outfit. Um, I'm trying to recall, I think this clicks, hold on, let me double check. This clicks might be something that was uh, in between for my last stream. Let me take a look. Yeah, looks like it was. Okay. So this uh, Clicks Locker Bundle was new. It, it came. It debuted uh, yesterday, actually. It looks like. So I do recommend this because if well, I'll say this. It all depends what you have in your locker. The actual bundle itself is twenty three hundred. So as you can see, and this is what really grinds my gears. I've already bought the glider, the wrap, and the emo. So in my opinion, just to make you aware. The glider's 1200, the emote is 600, and the wrap is 500. So technically, I've already paid for this bundle. This should be zero. It's 2300. These three items are 2300. So it really grinds my gears that this bundle couldn't have been released before, or it should be free. Now, obviously, if I pay 200, I will get the outfit and this pickaxe that people really have been wanting and waiting for which I don't know if I'm really a fan of it, but let me just show you the overall bundle itself, which is 2300. Um, so as you can see, it includes a spark plug outfit, 
there's a default and the ink look. I don't know, surprisingly, people do really like this skin. The black one, I guess, is sort of okay. I don't know if I'm really a fan of the markings and, like, I don't know, the cutoff. I don't know if I'm really a fan of the outfit, really, in general. The blue, eh. So, really, the outfit, to me, I'm not really as liking as a lot of people seem to. The black one is sort of okay. I don't know about this blue one. The scrappy back lane, disappointed with this back lane. There's a default on the engine. I really don't like either of the back lanes. And then the cold snap pickaxe, which people for some reason have been wanting and waiting, and people do seem to like it. I don't know. I find it kind of mess sounding. And I'm not a fan of the look of the pickaxe itself. I really don't even feel it blends with the with the outfit either. Now we have the Magic Wings Glider, which I do recommend. Very nice. I love that deploy. The Chugga Chugga Emote, which is a traversal and a sync emote, so other people will ride the train with you. And the Splatter Spectrum Wrap, which I do recommend, hence the reason why I got it. So to me, this is only like a, I don't know, I think of the bundle, kind of like the stuff I kind of got is what I like. I'm really not much of a fan of the rest, but in my case, for 200 V-Bucks, I doesn't make sense to not get it just because of the price differential. But for me, I does grind my gears. It should be free. I shouldn't even be paying any V-Bucks in my firm, humble opinion. All right, so this Ocean's Finest. Let's see. I think a couple things might have come in since I last uh yeah so it looks like this one this deep sea bundle came in which was uh which was yeah which was since my last stream here so actually says it came in yes no today okay weird so this deep sea bundle comes with a deep sea dominator an octo tank it's 2000 v bucks for six items uh octo tank back bling. so deep sea destroy so it's deep sea divers i don't know the rebreather back bling. A Kraken Axe pickaxe. I actually like the look of the pickaxe. Not really a fan of the sound though. And then the Nautilus glide, Nautilus glider. Eh, I don't know. I'm like I'm pretty lukewarm in this whole bundle. Each outfit is 1,500 individually. The pickaxe is five, and the glider's 12. All right, this fish sticks bundle is starting to become a copy and paste bundle. But I think this was offered since the last time I previously streamed. But before that, um, before yesterday, it was just offered on June 25th. So this is really becoming a copy and paste deal. Very common. So and it's actually for 2200 The reason it's showing on my screen for 1600 because I already own this Fishy Flourish emo and the music, meaning the sticks. So in total, it's going to come with these nine items. comes with the fish stick outfit. You get a default a pirate and a VR look and then you get a saltwater satchel with only one look a coral cruiser glider I do like the deploy sound with that music and the little dancing like uh, uh, creatures there the bootstraps pickaxe not really a fan of that the sounds okay uh, the slippery you get a slippery wrap a fish face wrap and a fishy wrap. The fishy flourish emote, which I do, which I did get. And then the Meet Me in the Sticks music, which is the music for that emote. So individually, the outfit's 1200, the pickaxe is five, the uh, emote is four, the music is, is two, the glider is 800, and each wrap is 300. All right, now I'm trying to figure out, was this bundle, this Princess Felicity between when I last streamed? Let me take a look if it was, because I don't quite recall. Actually, it was. Okay. So, four item bundle for 1800 So, it has Princess Felicity Fish. You get a default and a summer look. The Flutterfish Backling. A, one, a Water Wand Pickaxe. I do like that deploy and contact. The Aqua Royale Wrap. I think this wrap might be the best part of this bundle but because it does flash pretty nicely um and then individually the outfit's 1200 the pickaxe is eight and the wrap is 500 and it looks like we reach another repeat portion because all these other ones were previously offered 
Yes, they were. So it says special offers and bundles, and the Fortnite Crusoe Crew Legacy set. All right. So just to do my uh, courtesy quick look, which I kind of wanted to do before, but this is Dirty Gamer here with the uh, quick look for today's item shop here. So they brought Squad Origins back. Again, another copy and paste that they're really repeating. They brought back the Markman bundle, which I do recommend. And they brought back the Across the Spider-Verse bundle. And you can see some Marvel items as well, which they've been splitting up in their releases, which is kind of weird. The, still here is the uh, same stuff here with the uh, collab with the uh, Elder Scrolls Online. They brought back John Cena. Pause. Six Locker's new. Uh, this bundle's new here for the Deep Sea bundle. And they brought back another copy and paste special with the Ocean's Finest of uh, the Fish Stick Bundle. And again, Ocean's Finest, a lot of stuff here that's been offered over the past few days. So yeah, that's going to do it for the quick look. Uh, so in terms of my personal recommendations, be the Fortnite Crew Sub, uh, the Boardwalk Warriors Pack, which I'm surprised is still here, actually the summer event being long gone, the slurp wrap, the angel fish wrap, uh, the sea glow bundle, especially if you already don't own it, most of the items which I already did, just the blazes while life was missing, uh, kind of burn, I'm kind of, I'm kind of, I'm kind of grinding my gear about this bundle, bundle should have been offered very much well before. The Meet Me, the Sticks Music, the Fishy Flourish Emotes. Uh, and in my case, it would be the Locker Bundle. But of these, I would definitely recommend the Wrap, the Glider, and the Pickaxe. But obviously, if you're getting that, you're basically paying for the bundle. So in that specific case, oh, excuse me, the Emote, the Wrap, and the Glider, you're just better off just getting the bundle because it's the same price. Yet, I still have to pay 200 V-Bucks, which burn, burns my gears. It should be free in my case. The Venom Outfit, the Spider-Man Zero Bundle. The Across the Spider-Verse Bundle. The Shattered Ice Wrap and the Oblivion Outfits. The Marked Man Bundle. And yeah, that's going to do it there in terms of the item shop. Now, in terms of the quest, I don't think much has changed. As you can see, I still got to work on these Trigger Fish quests. I'm up to stage 2 of 4 for dealing damage to opponents while in water or boat to work on that to get 100 damage. I'm a little bit closer on my uh, rank rewards. Uh, 19 away from the total of 15 to get that finally, that burning bright emote. Uh, the quests are going to vary. And yeah, I still got to work on these weekly ones here. I got to land at breakaway, breakwater or steamy springs to, and finish in the top 20. That's sequitur there. Deal damage to scope weapons and eliminate opponents with SMGs. Only just one of those. <laughs> kind of weird that all of a sudden my GG Gleam emoticon just randomly decided to claim. However, what's not showing for me to claim is that uh, the Luna, the Fortnite Luma, excuse me, to where you would Luna to play Fortnite via that to get that pickaxe. I never got it. So yeah, I'm pretty burned about that. So again, it's another quest which did not work, which I, again, did rightfully so. So that's going to do it. Uh, so this has been Dirty Gamer here. Let me know if you're interested, what you think. You're intending on purchasing anything from the shop update. Will you be adding anything to your collection? Uh, let me know how you feel about the latest update and the quests. Did you or somebody know have a birthday? Shout out, comments, or questions? You can answer any and all by dropping a comment. Liking up, thumbs up, commenting, subscribing, and sharing my videos all without my content to be seen from my YouTube channel, Dirty with Two R's Gamer, and have those bell notifications turned on. I also live stream on Twitch, which I'm doing here, and please follow me also free. Enjoy my live streams and chatting gaming sessions at the username Dirty with Two R's underscore Gamer. For super thanks, would appreciate donations via my link. All right, that's going to do it. So later to all and to the chat here on Twitch, let's keep supporting, networking, and growing together. Get your game on and your game dirt here. Please don't forget to like, comment, follow, and subscribe. All is appreciated.